Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. I just wanted to come on really quick and share with you all what I picked up from Sephora today. I literally just walked in the door five minutes ago. I walked in, put my bags here on the counter, grabbed my camera, switched out the battery, and here we are. This is going to be a quick little video. As promised in my last video where I shared with you all my recommendations, I do wanna share with you all the items that I did pick up in store today so before we get into the products let me just give you guys a little backstory so i was on the site at around 5 a.m this morning i had already been building up my cart so basically all i needed to do was put in the discount code and check out so got in put in my discount code also i had a gift card that was sent to me by my friend brie for my birthday thank you so much brie i appreciate you more than you even know and she sent me the sweetest card so i put in all my stuff i'm getting ready to check out four of the items are not at the store that i was going to pick up from so i had to move all that stuff out of the cart into like my loved cart for one store. Got the items checked out for that store, went back in, moved everything from my loved cart back into the cart, selected the other Sephora that I go to, two items are out. So I'm like, okay. So I checked out those two items. Something said, just wait a little bit. It's too early, really. Nobody's in the store, the store's not even open. So just wait before you go to another store because I did not want to do three trips. So I was like, okay. So placed that order with that store since those items were in stock. So I got my two orders placed and I'm like, okay, I got these two random items just floating around waiting for me to see if the store is gonna get them in stock. So in the meantime, I'm shopping, I find more stuff. So I'm like, okay, let me pause before I like overspend and just start buying stuff that I don't need. Well, what ended up happening is I started doing more research and a few items that I was going to replenish, I ended up saying, you know what, let me just try some new stuff. And so I got rid of those items, put in some new stuff that I wanted to try. And those items were available at one of my stores. So I ended up with three orders, two orders at one store, one location, and then another order at another location. So yeah that's how my morning went and once they all emailed and said everything was ready to be picked up that's when i headed out and picked up all of my items so that's what i'm going to share with you guys today i really didn't get a whole lot but i'm excited about the items that i got that are new which i got a lot of new stuff um, that i'm excited to try out so everything is in these two bags i actually had one store just combined the items in one big bag for me. So the first skincare item I got is the Tasha the Rice Wash. I did mention to you guys that I was gonna be trying this out. So I'm excited to try this. A lot of you in the comments told me that you guys use this with the Youth to the People and it works great. So that made me feel really, really good about this purchase. So I went ahead and grabbed it. So I'm excited to try this out. It softens and boosts luminosity. Hyaluronic acid, ceramide rich algae, hydrates, pH neutral, amino acid base, gently cleanses. Oh, um, yeah, I got that. And I got this in the four fluid ounce. It, I think it comes in a bigger one, but they didn't have the big one in stock. So I just got this one. So yeah, I'm excited to try it out and I will let you guys know how I'm liking it. So that's the first item I got. And then I picked up another Glow Recipe Watermelon Dew Drops. You guys know I told you I was gonna be picking up another one of these to replenish my one that is out. I absolutely love this product so much. It is one of my favorite serums that I own and definitely wanted to add this back into my skincare regimen because it's been working great for me. So I got another one of those and this I got in the 1.35 fluid ounce, which is the same as yeah, these are the same size, so I can actually toss that one. And then this came highly recommended by my girl Keiko. She swears by the Dr. Dennis Gross Daily 
pill pads I just got the five treatments um, just to test them out to see how I like them but I do love all of the reviews that um, were on Sephora it has really really good reviews again this is a product that so many people rave about and so I was looking for something that wasn't too harsh I think I just got the original one so yeah, I picked this up, helps smooth fine lines, minimize the look of pores, and improves the appearance of uneven tone and texture. And so that's mainly what I wanna focus on is just kinda of like evening out the texture of my skin, just so that it has a more smooth look um, if that makes sense like I don't have a lot of texture to my skin but if you get close up on it there is some texture so I'm hoping that this does the trick and if it does I'm going to start using this like tonight so that if I need to re-up before the sale is over I can hurry and buy um, more at a good price and these are not cheap even this five treatments pack was $20 so I got that this also came highly recommended by my girl Keiko, Keiko Beauty here on YouTube. It's the Belief, the True Cream Aqua Bomb Facial Cream. So I'm so excited to try this out because you guys know I was saying that I wanted to try out a new face um, face cream, something lightweight for the spring and summer and all the reviews on this product are like five stars. Like people love this product. So I'm hoping that I love it as well. And it seems like something that I would love. And so, yeah. Refreshing gel cream provides weightless yet intensive hydration. That is exactly what I'm looking for. I'm looking for something lightweight, but still has my skin looking just as hydrated as it does when I'm using my heavier creams. Yeah, and I got this in the 1.68 fluid ounce. I think this is the middle size. It comes in a smaller size, which I almost got, but I was like, no, I'm gonna get the, the big one because I have a feeling I'm gonna like it. And then it comes in a really big like value size. Oh, I'm hoping that I really like this because if so, this will be my go-to moisturizer for spring and summer and possibly all year round. So. I got that. I will obviously link all this stuff for you guys as well. They also included a sample of the Amika Dream Routine Overnight Hydration Treatment. So that, all right. And moving on to the like makeup and other skincare stuff. So I got another Summer Friday Sheer Skin Tint tinted moisturizer and my shade is six so I got another one of those um, I picked up a new mascara so I decided to try the tower 28 make waves mascara you guys know I am obsessed with the YSL mascara but I was like you know what I want to try a new mascara and so this came highly recommended so I can't wait to try this out <laughs> lightweight conditioning formula with easy wash off technology keeps irritation and breakage at bay yeah that is why I grabbed this because the way they described it, it just sounds like something that I would really enjoy, especially the part about easy to remove and conditioning. I do like that in mascaras. I don't like for my mascaras to make my eyelashes feel too crunchy. I'm looking forward to trying the Tower 28 brand because I have not tried anything from that line and so this will be my first product that I'm trying out. Let me know if you guys have tried any of the Tower 28 products and if there's something that you recommend for me to try. Next up, I picked up another Summer Friday Pink Sugar Lip Balm. Told you guys I was going to get a backup of this, so I grabbed that. And then I grabbed another NARS Creamy Concealer in the shade 1.5 Medium Deep. Yeah, medium deep. So I got that. And then I decided not to do another Dior lip 
oil and I decided to go with the House Labs by Lady Gaga um, the PhD hybrid lip oil I heard really 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 good things about this and it had really good reviews I got it in the shade tint I think is that the shade tint but it's just like this pink and let's just see so here's how it looks actually let's just test this out real quick real quick it does have the doe foot applicator like the Dior okay it feels good it feels very similar to the to the Dior lip oil so yeah pick that up and then the last product that I picked up was the K skin body lotion SPF 45 and I actually thought that I got the other one they gave me the wrong one so I ordered the um, K skin SPF 45 for the face and they gave me the one for the body but I might keep this though I do need a new body sunscreen so so yeah this is a glowing body lotion with UVA UVB protection and a lightweight hydrating texture that applies flawlessly on all skin tones for a pearlescent glow so yeah guys that is everything that I picked up from Sephora today I got a few other things that have to be shipped to me that are not available in any stores so I'll definitely share that stuff with you guys once I receive those items I'm excited to try everything out let me know what you guys recommend if you all have tried any of these new products that I'm trying out if so how do you like them also send me some more recommendations if there's something that you think I would like to try yeah that's everything that I wanted to share with you all thank you so so much to Sephora and Magic Links for partnering with me on this video. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll catch you on my next one. Bye!